fire the fire that burns the fire that burns like like not the good fire kind of product the fire that burns welcome back to our channel so today we'll be talking about this product um Lycas papaya body lotion yeah just one uh a lot of you already know about this lotion it also yes there is the Lycas papaya body soap yeah, so we'll be talking about this Lycas papaya product. So what made me go back, back into the years to like dig out this product? I remember when it used to trend. A lot of people said it works very well on their skin. I even went back to the reviews like four years ago, five years ago, and you know now. On Makeup Alley and amazon and the rest and i still saw the reviews like they were really nice reviews so i decided to go back and try this stuff again because i noticed that okay the story is this i was looking for something i was in a fix i needed something to use like there was no time to go back to go to get what i normally use my lotion and my soap and i didn't have enough time so this was the only thing i could choose from from the um, supermarket I went to so I decided to try it again and see if anything has changed over the years and hmm, I bring good news and bad news so yeah sometimes it's better it's wise for you to go back and go back and find out those things that you used to work for you then try it again because now you bear me witness that the kind of things you're seeing in the markets now it's a no no so there is this competition i mean amongst um producers of cosmetics and skincare um stuffs lotions soaps and the rest both the ones that are internal like the locally one local ones and the international ones they are in a battle to outdo each other and so then you see a lot of lies now it's very difficult for you to even trust in labels but you can't do anything about it you just have to like keep going i mean just pray and do the little research you can and then pick your products and pray it works fine on your on you yeah because if you are among the people that your goal is whitening then it's not bad but that means that you will be a victim to most of these people that do all these um, substandard products and the rest except if you already have someone you trust and you're not going to move your shift your trust then fine but let's talk about this lotion I think I made the right choice going back to this lotion I mean I had other choices so, but I decided to just try it because it's it felt like the safer choice for me at that time but I noticed that this particular one this one this one it's like it's changed like it's it's a whole different product I don't even know if it's the same company that made the soap that made this lotion so on the body it says it's like has Kojic and Muta lotion skin herbal lotion for face and body first filipino pure organic herbal lotion that's the issue once you see organic and herbal in one product if they fear me for real it scares me because once you see these people that formulate um lotions and soaps and then they add organic and herbal just know that they are trying to mask something I mean the best to the best of my knowledge they are trying to mask something there is one heavy gengenge ingredients they put to maybe finish wall but they don't want to list it so they just mention organic or half out or i don't know i don't know i don't know about this one anyway so it says 
enriched with turmeric, alpha butin powder, kojic and muta enzyme. Now any product I check, I make a research on and I find both kojic acid and glutathione in it and the normal is supposed to be a very nice product for real it's supposed to be a very nice product because and yes it's going to whiten too or lighten or whichever but it's going to turn up your skin but then for you to add kojic and gluta i hope you don't add any other stuff that whitening to that particular stuff because it's going to be like fire the fire that burns the fire that burns like like not the good fire kind of products, the fire that burns in your skin. Yeah, so don't trust those kind of products. I did not my own do it. So this one says it it is enriched with turmeric, alpha butin powder, kojic and gluta enzyme and blended with tropical herbs to whiten the skin in 14 days for clearer and finer skin complexion. That's my fear about this lotion. Going back to Lyca Papaya Soap, even though because of the then because of the papaya, which was the major ingredient it contained, people assumed that it was going to be a skin um, a, so a whitening soap, but it wasn't actually whitening. It never whitened. In fact, it wasn't a whitening soap, but it was used to heal heal um, slight pigmentation issues on the skin. That's what I can say about the soap. But this new stuff here, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. The only thing that, the only reason I'm still like having a little hope in it is the fact that it's it's not Nigerian made. I'm sorry to say. So it says it's a skin protecting lotion that gives complete defense from the sun. Meaning it contains a sort of um, SPF, SPF 30, yeah. As it visibly whitens in just 14 days. SPF 30 effectively shields the skin against harmful UV, UVA and UVB rays to prevent darkening while micro-encapsulated. Anyway, see, and from the ingredients, I can see kojic acid water, I can see giga white powder. You know what that means. I can see gluta, citric acid, and yeah, almond oil that's a good one. So, I've been oil that's a good one, and some kind of roots that are all in there. I can see amino acid, carboma, fragrance, raw Egyptian oil, Indian no stress oil. If they are saying the truth, in the best composition, in the best accurate composition, this lotion is okay. But in the hands of someone that is not a professional with these ingredients, this lotion is a no-no. Okay, so the fact that it's manufactured by um, a village in the Philippines makes me like have a little hope in them. Okay, so it's worth the try. It's worth the try. Yes, guys, it is. But. If you don't get my nude one, no user. Okay. So for me, I've tried the cream. Let's say four times now. I've tried it on my body four times now, and I can say so far I haven't noticed any changes. Not in whitening, not in the dark knuckle aspect, which I hate so much, or the green vein aspect. Not in any way has it affected my skin. So maybe I'll use it and finish this container by the grace of God and then I'll come back and give you guys feedback on this lotion. But so far, it's looking like something I can try, okay, for you guys. I can try for you guys. But 
if you're not patient enough if you don't want to be patient enough you want to go on and buy your own before i finish trying for you you want to use it fine no but i advise you to get a good supplement and a vitamin c a good water and a vitamin c supplement and combine with the solution the reason is not for whitening the reason is so it can prevent you from getting all those issues like um dark muscles and vents and the rest let it let the supplement work from the net your skin your body to heal you so that even if this cream is happens not to be so good in your on your body you won't like get affected by it so much okay so take my advice guys if you must try this for now get a good supplement a glute and a vitamin c supplement uh, yes 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 i remember i said i was going to make a video for you guys um a video about retinoin that's retinol i haven't forgotten okay i haven't something has been preventing me from making that video but i promise i'll make it very soon okay so going online i went to search on the reviews for this product and the soap recent reviews by human people like real people not robots or the rest and i was somewhat pleased with what i saw i'll be reading out some of those reviews for you guys this one is from amazon and the other one is from the makeup alley um okay i'll be reading our reviews from the united states apparently the lotion and the soap it's even popular people are people are using it so this person says it does nothing for my skin not moisturizing it makes my skin super dry the water turns orange i think he's talking about the soap i've never seen lycas do that to the water and i've been using lycas for years it's not whitening also this was expensive for a pack of six this review was done january 22nd 2022 it's a very recent one so i must say that a lot of fakes exist when it comes to lycas papaya soap a lot of fakes i've seen a lot of them if you google um lycas papaya soap and you go to your images on google what you will see it will fear you you may even be disheartened into buying from buying the soap yeah so try and find out how the original looks like before you get it okay so um maybe i'll make a video for you guys or in my next video i will tell you what the original looks like yeah so let me note it down so this person said uh, i've been using this for years it's very effective someone else says wow it only after less than a week of use my skin tone is more even that's a very positive one and this one says i use the soaps and the lotion to brighten under regions and i've never been happier pits and such look new i think she means she uses the soap to brighten her armpits and her lower region and also it helps with the clean with cleaning cause sono gene funk left behind in armpits and otherwise i guess you understand that so someone says it's good for my sensitive skin so i guess that means anybody can use it but if you're dark complexion and you're not looking i'm look, um, looking forward to whitening or toning your skin please don't use it okay don't use the lotion you're free to use the soap i don't think the soap does anything like whitening yeah so i'll read out five more reviews then we're done okay i think we spent a lot of time with this someone says um I'm not sure if this is the one from the Philippines. Different smell. The texture is is kind of gooey. The one from the Philippines is way better than this. Even though the packaging, even even the packaging, 
and also there is already a mold on it when I opened it so I'm guessing that if really she's saying that the Philippine um, produce is the original one then this lotion will be a good one because it's made in that particular village in the Philippines and I'm sure or I think it's the same village that made the soap yeah I mean my problem is just that these containers they are looking alike nowadays this one and the Egyptian magic gold whatever and also the container of um the skin is this is not skin success the other one they're like three different makers producers that produce different lotions and then their containers are looking alike you see this gold stuff this gold stuff here writing and all of them and you see you you notice this spf drawing here on all of them at the same position and then even the fonts they use in writing some of the things are like the same then you wonder uh -uh, what's happening you see the same person that is making these different creams or what so those are the things the reasons why i get i get i feel somehow when buying all these products but from these reviews again is a plus is what the try so this one says um, if you've got smelly on the arm pro problems like as papaya seems to have relieved me of this dilemma try it it may, this, it may do the same for you i think he's talking about the soap someone else says This soap, this soap is so great and I paired it with a lotion it's even better so this says my mom used the lotion that's why I'm trying to correct the English for them so that you guys will understand what they're trying to say my mom used the lotion I didn't expect how it turned out seeing the fact that she always makes poor decisions on her products now i'm forced to go and look for it find it and use it for myself that's a really good one that's a really good one so i guess we will be trying this one okay so we'll try like us kojik and group and make sure is that i think they have three types they have the um this one the kojik and Gluta one they have the let me get the size for you I'm gone. I'm on their websites right now. They have the Kojic and Gluta, this one you're seeing. They have the white and orange one. That one is the whitening herbal carrot lotion. And they also have the Lycas whitening herbal papaya lotion. That's strictly papaya. There is carrot, there is papaya, and then this is Kojic and Gluta. So 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 guys i've done it all for you guys you can go and enjoy your cream and your lotion thank you so much for being in this video with me have you subscribed if you haven't please do that now let's get to 1000 subscribers and start making money on youtube i love you guys